Hi, welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Today I have a huge Timu haul to share with you guys. This is my first time ever buying from Timu, so I'm going to see if it is worth the hype. If you guys like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. Now let's get into this. Look at this. I have gotten three packages from Timu for this one haul. I have spent almost $400 on this. Let's see if this is worth it. Now, this haul is mainly going to be stuff that I picked up that we could use for a wedding. Not all of it, but the majority of it. Now, right off the bat here, one of my packages came with this big rip in it, and I'm hoping that everything is still in here. We'll see. Now, let's get right into this first one. I'm going to start with the smallest one. Get this open. Let's see what's in here. And this is gold dye powder that I got for baking. This, I thought that maybe I could use it like on the flowers or something, on the wedding cake, or maybe on some of the cookies. Something I could just kind of dust it with a little bit of this powder. I've never used this before. I'm going to have to research to even see how to use it. But that is the idea. It's maybe just making some of the things extra pretty with some of this gold powder. Now I paid $4.48 for that bottle of gold powder. Now let's get into our next bag here. And the first thing I'm pulling out here is this is a hair accessory that I bought for my daughter that I thought maybe she might like to wear in her hair on her wedding day. It's really pretty. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Let me show you a little bit closer here. It has the pearls. You can see it has like this barrette clip to it. Very pretty. It has like pearls and rhinestones. It has kind of um, ivory color flowers on it. It's very delicate. I really like this. And this was only $4.99. Now the next thing I'm pulling out here this is a package of envelopes. Now, I bought my invitations on Amazon, actually, and I love the invitations I bought. But I saw these envelopes, and I just thought these were really pretty. They have gold on the back side here, but each of the front corners just has this little gold dot on it. And then look at the back here with the gold going around. I just thought this was really pretty and would just be a really nice addition to the invitations that I picked up for her. So I'm very happy with these. And the envelopes did cost $10.17 for a pack of 50. Now next here, this is some eucalyptus garland. I don't know about this. Let me take it out here. It's looking kind of plasticky in this bag. Let me take it out and let me see. This, this is more plasticky and um, a little more faux, let's say, than what I was hoping for. Now, for the price of it, it really wasn't bad. It was $9.44. I know I ordered at least two of these. So hopefully they're both in here, but it's not as great as what I would have hoped for it to be. The leaves just look, a, okay, the leaves look very, very fake. So it's not as great as like a Hobby Lobby garland would be, or at least one of their nicer ones. They do carry some that look pretty faux as well. But so it looks like they had two strands and then they kind of twist them together on here. And it is fairly full, but it's not my favorite. I wouldn't say I absolutely hate it, but I would use this someplace where people are not going to be up close really looking at it 
for it and that's just me. Somebody else may absolutely love this and make it look beautiful. That's just my own personal taste. It's not my favorite being kind of plasticky. Oh, and here is the second one. So this is the exact same as the first one we just opened and showed you. And like I said, I did pay $9.44 each for those. Now this is a, a white chiffon arch drape. And let me see here. This is actually really pretty. I like this. It has a nice weight to it, but it's very sheer. It looks like it will drape lovely. I love the chiffon fabric. So I actually think this is a good one and a good deal. This was $13.58 for this arch drape. Now this is chiffon, so there's no stretch or give to it. So, but this, should be a beautiful draping fabric. Now the next thing I have here is a set of gold food tongs that I picked up. Now they say that these are actually stainless steel, but they are gold color and I do like that. These have a nice weight to them and I like that. They look like they work fine. They're nice, heavy. I wish they were maybe just a touch longer, but these are not bad. These are a good, a good deal. I'm happy with these. And I paid $3.98 for those. And this is nothing for the wedding. This is actually just something I picked up for my husband. This is a little carpenter square, kind of triangle ruler. And you have to kind of hook it together and then you can put it on like a two by four or a four by six or something. And you can actually measure the sides as well as the top. And so this is just a little tool that I picked up for my husband. And this actually cost $7.47. And you can see it came with a little Allen wrench and a couple of the little screws to kind of hook this together. So I think he'll be happy with that. Now this, I don't quite remember what this is. Let me see here. I think all this came in about 12 days. Now this is in a little burlap bag here. And let me take it out and, okay, I remember what this is. This is a little ring box. It says Mr. and Mrs. on the front of it. I thought that was really cute. And there is room for three rings in there. And this, I only paid $5.68 for this. And I actually think this, this is a really good deal. I'm happy with this. It's wood. It has little magnets here on the front corners. And it seems to like hold that really secure. It doesn't just like flap open. You have to really kind of pull to open that. So I actually really like this. And I think this is a good deal. Now next here, this is kind of making me laugh. I was not expecting these to be this little. This was double-sided tape and it showed that it came in 10 rolls of it. And the pictures that they showed on their site made this look quite a bit bigger. And this is really small. You can see here, there's very little tape on this. Even though there's 10 of them in here, I was expecting it like this. I was expecting this great big and these are really tiny. Now, I only paid $1.79 for these, but would I buy this again? No. Now, this next item here, let me get this open.
and this is a little gold plate and this is real nice shiny this is metal this is stainless steel as well so I really like these it has a good weight to it very pretty I actually got these to go ahead and put the tongs or serving spoons and stuff on as they're going through the buffet line so and I actually got two of these plates and these plates were four dollars and 94 cents each now next this looks really cute I'm not quite sure what it is I think I know but let's just double check here to make sure I like how it has a little heart here on the front it's this little envelope and open yeah that's what I thought this was gonna be okay these I thought this was a really neat idea this is his and her vow books so that they can write their vows here in the book and instead of going and just holding a piece of paper up there while they're saying their vows to each other what they've written to each other they can actually have it all in this little book I like that so much better I always see people just holding a piece of paper and I just thought this would make it so much nicer and then they can go ahead and keep these so I really like this yeah I think this is really worth it and that was only two dollars and 87 cents so I really do think that is a great deal it has a little pearlized little envelope thing here that it fits in so I definitely think that was a good deal now let's see this bag here okay this is a different type of tongue that I purchased and let me pull these out again these are stainless steel they have a nice weight to them I like how long these ones are very easy to use they feel sturdy these I think are going to be a really good deal I like these a lot and those tongs there were eight dollars and 48 cents now let's get this next thing open and this is a set of eight gold serving spoons I really like this now there were four slotted serving spoons and four non-slotted serving spoons let me take these out so I can show you now these again have a nice weight to them they're metal there's the stainless steel the only thing I'm not crazy about is they're a little short I wish that they were about two inches longer for a buffet I think they would have been a little bit better if they were longer these are like a serving spoon you would get with your regular dishes or your regular silverware at home and that's great for at home I wish they were a little bit longer for a buffet I will probably still go ahead and use these because I absolutely love the color of them and those serving spoons I paid thirteen dollars and seventy six cents for that package of eight of them now let's see what we have here now this is some jewelry that I bought I just thought this looked really pretty I've never ordered from Timu before so I didn't know what to expect of their jewelry but this seems really pretty it is a necklace and earrings um, my daughter will be doing a couple different um, dress changes at her wedding and so I wanted to get her some different jewelry for the different outfits that she'll be wearing and so I think this is really pretty and could definitely go with one of her dresses and this was actually a really good um, price point on this this is five dollars and thirty nine cents you didn't really see the shine in the like cubic zirconia there but it did have a nice shine to it now let's see this is a cake set 
It is also in the gold and it has the little like pie server and it had the knife to it. The pie server seems definitely a little short to me. I, again, the handle is very short on that. Not super impressed with the length of that. The knife is a perfect size, seems regular, long, everything. The cake server or pie server is just the handle portion is a little short. Now I would give it like a three and a half star. And that set costs $4.89. Now let's see. Okay, this is a veil that I bought my daughter on here. This veil looked gorgeous and I had, I didn't really have a lot of hopes for this. But it looked really pretty in the picture, so I thought I would go ahead and give it a try. And the applique on here, the lace applique, is actually gorgeous. I love this. This is so pretty. I got it in the ivory. So it is very, very pretty. Love that. This is a cathedral length veil, and it has the applique that goes halfway up the side of it. So I really like that. This is one of those things I really, I was getting, but I didn't really have a whole lot of hopes for. But I actually think this is gorgeous. I am really liking this. Now we'll have to see because all the stuff that I picked up, of course, this is not my wedding. It's my daughter's wedding. So it will be up to her whether she wants to use any of this and whether she likes it, she may, she may not. But for me, I think that this veil is absolutely gorgeous. Here is the comb part at the top of it. Now, a lot of veils I've seen at the bridal shops are very expensive, so this is a winner to me. And this veil was only $15.99. Now, the next thing we have here are just some shoulder pads. And I know I got these in two different colors, some white and some black. And there's not much cushion to the one side, but there is about a half an inch on the other side. These are supposed to be in a pack of five. And these shoulder pads were $3.14. Now this next thing we have here, looks like it's another little package of jewelry that I picked up and these are some I thought these were really pretty the picture was just gorgeous I was anxious to get these these are just a little pearl kind of a teardrop shape with little cubic zirconias going around it and let me just show you a better picture of these earrings here's the little card that the earrings probably should have been put on but here are the earrings. I think these are absolutely just gorgeous. These are really pretty. And these little earrings were only $1.34. That is well worth it in my opinion. Love those. Now next I have this ring. This is an amber colored ring, but I accidentally ordered this obviously in way too big of a size. This is huge on my fingers. Even this middle finger, it just wants to twist and turn. Now, I have a thing, I, a lot of my rings just twist on me, but this one is really big. I ordered this in a size eight, and I probably should have gotten like a size six, seven at the highest. So it's a pretty ring. I just think it is way too big. And I paid $1.74 for that. Now let's check this next package. Okay, we have another set of these tongs. I know I just showed you a pair of these. These tongs, like I said a minute ago, were $8.48. They're a nice heavy feel to them. Now, let me look at this. This, I don't know, maybe the rest of these are in one of the other packages. Because I ordered two packs of these 
and it was supposed to be two packs with metal floral hoops and to make a centerpiece. There are definitely not 16 of these here. So I paid $8.45 a piece for these. I'm hoping the rest are in the other packages and they just had to ship them separately. Looks like some feet for the bottom of this wood here. And it comes with this ribbon. It looks like they have little holes drilled in the sides of the wood. And then you just go ahead and poke the hoops right into the holes. Let's see here. Well, okay, that should be how it works. Let's try this again. Okay, well, the hole is not drilled large enough to put this metal hoop into. No matter, even when I really push on it, it is not going into that hole. But this is how it should be. Let me kind of move this where you can see it better here. Let me bend this down. There, that's how it should work. In order for this one to work, I would have to drill those holes a little bit bigger. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not really crazy about this item. The fact that I paid $8.45 a piece for these and they don't fit in. I mean, it's kind of a cute idea, but I'm not exactly loving it here. Hopefully, I'll have the rest of them in my other package, and maybe the rest of them will fit better than this one did. Maybe this is a one-off. I'm not sure. We'll have to check that out. So, this isn't one of my favorite things, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to keep an open mind on this one. That is what I got in this Timu bag. And now I have the largest bag still to go through yet. I'm going to go ahead and end this video and I will put a part two of this video up. Let's see together whether or not Timu is worth it and what we spent. If you like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. Thanks so much for watching.